Hey everyone, it's Rose Collectors here. We're opening up some Walgreens Football Collectors Edge boxes. I believe these are from MJ Holding. These are $5 a piece, and sometimes you can find them at your Walgreens, sometimes you can't. We happen to see a bunch of them on the shelves. They also had baseball. They don't really have a whole bunch more for retail when we were there, um, but they did have Squishmallows, so you know if you're looking for those, those are always fun. Um, anyways, let's get into these. Let us know in the comments below, did you find these and what did you pull from them? Uh, we've done these in past videos. Sometimes they're sneaky good, sometimes eh. For $5, they're interesting. Yeah, it's kind of fun because you do, one thing that we have found, you know, that's why I say comment below is people tell us stuff they find in these things and there's some good stuff to be found. I think I do remember that these things are Oh yeah, they're like open. glued with like Gorilla Glue or something. I think if you go from the, yeah. yeah, there we go. Bottom. Go from the bottom. Anti-theft device. Let's take a peek. Mm, looks <laughs> like some interesting stuff. We got a pack. What is that? Fleer, Fleer? Premiere 1990. 1990 Fleer. Jonathan Taylor, baller. Patrick Taylor, so some Premier Draft Sage Head cards. Um, Jerry Judy, Lynn Bowden, Bowman, Calvert. Oh, there he is, the GOAT, Henry Ruggs. Jonathan Taylor. And. Maybe get some interesting stuff in the middle here. We've got, we pulled some hits out of here before, haven't we, out of these boxes? I think so. Yeah. Collector's choice. It's pretty cool. Super Bowl ticket. Oh, Super Bowl ticket. Sweet. Uh, Smith. A Lamar. That's actually pretty cool. Lamar Woodley Trophy Club press pass. And they had the college uh, license. This is like 2007. Yeah. Bowman draft picks. Not Baker Mayfield. Al Toon. He was good. Al Toon was a good receiver. Some no, old crown. Not Jeff, Jeff Graham. Graham. No, he wasn't that good. Interesting. I've been a Chargers fan for a long time, so no, he wasn't. Draft class score, what year is that? 97. What is that? 94? Um, like, is that a sports flicks, or what is that thing? Uh, kind of. Turn that. Yeah, no, it is a sports yeah, flicks. Sport, yeah. And that's uh, 55. Who is that? Quinton Coriat? Oh, yeah, I know. I know. I remember him, yeah. And 18, oh, or Mark, 18 or 17 Mark dollars. Rippin? And Alex Collins. Interesting. Mark Rippin, I think, was a Super Bowl um, he went to quarterback. A Super Bowl. I, I believe really. so. Interesting. But, but what year? That's 90? 90. I think that's the year they went to the Super Bowl and won, I think. But... They beat the Cheers. they beat the Lions um, in the championship. Everybody beats the Lions. The only time the Lions made it to the championship, they um, lost to the Washington Redskins. These are actually pretty nice looking cards. Yeah, they are. Scott Fulhage, a punter, cool. Chris Carter, nice. Ray Barry, Dan Ooh, the there Myth. he is, Marino, nice. Steve, Mark, Keith, Tom, and Pete. Oh, that um, uh. Last Bill, what's his name? Metzlars or whatever? Yeah. yeah, he, um, I saw him speak one time. Interesting. Cool guy? Yes. Yep. It was like a Christian athlete's, uh, sort of thing. So that was pretty kind Looks of like a pretty similar thing here. In fact, there's CD Lamb, see some different guys. Cole Komet, Jerry Judy, Lynn Bowden, Bowman, Calvert, Ruggs again, John Taylor again. And another pack of 90. There's an Ezekiel Anza. This looks like almost the exact same format. Yeah, Calvin sometimes Martin. they are. That's a different card. Interesting. Pacific. 95 rookie. I don't know. Stuff is a, weird. You, you could find some pretty good stuff in here. Scott Norwood. But, cause I'm it sure is, at some point. Look at, the, look at the year variety. It's very, yeah, very random. Very random. Like, I mean, 90s to modern day stuff. That is a cool card. Smith. <laughs> what is that thing? I don't know. It's a press pass. <laughs> press pass. Stick your fingers in yeah, the holes. Your it there looks like a uh, fidget spitter. Weird draft class. Another draft class. That's cool. Rookie. Coffin. Sport flicks. Those are sweet. Those are cool. Uh, sport flicks are real popular. Interesting. $5. I Yeah, I don't know. Um, I'll tell you what are good are the power cubes at Meyer. If you have a Meyer by you or a Walmart, I think they're at Walmarts too. The power yeah, cubes are power absolute cubes. heat. I, all of them, 
not all of them. Most of them, I've gotten 2018 Prisms. I've gotten Josh Allen rookies. I got a Patrick Mahomes Dunras rookie. I've probably opened up like 15 of them oh, at this Deion point. Deion Sanders. That's cool. Uh, yeah, so they're really good. Buy them if you see them. Now the pa- oh, there's Bo Jackson. Bo Jackson. That's pretty sweet. Um, the packs are pretty bad though. Right? There's nothing else in them besides the cards right. that are even worth it. Don't don't buy it because of the packs. Because have <laughs> you have you ever got a good pack out of those things? You get the same four every time, and they're it's all the sage same hit. Yeah. yeah. But the cards in the middle, you I I wouldn't say if you open up two of them, you're going to get something amazing. But if you open up five or six of them. Uh, you definitely your odds are in your favor. Okay, now one in every four of these has a hit in it. So, so let's see. By the odds, maybe. Oh, there's Jeremy Shockey. That's kind of cool. He was good. Eric Martin. He was pretty good for a while. Um, let's see here. Pro set. Pro set. Who this guy? That is sweet. That is a sweet. That card. is a sweet card. Oh, Billy Ray Smith. This guy is That's like cool. a um announcer or was an announcer for the Chargers. Billy Ray Smith, and I think he did local radio. Look at that. That that card is awesome. Tom Johnson. Uh, the one thing is, is these things are definitely screwed up. Yeah, they're flipped like every. They're like direction. flipped every direction. Um, Natron means he was a Super Bowl. Um player for the Chargers when they got destroyed by the uh, 49ers. He was a beast for a couple years. Terry Glenn. Terry Glenn. Not bad. Interesting. Th- th- these are actually quite fun. I, I'll whistle that. This is Super a, Fractor. There he is. Charles Haley. Super Fractor. What is this card? I don't know. That's weird. It's cool. weird. What years? Let us know what this is if you know that. It's like a foily uh, one. It looks like kind of like a. It actually does look like a super fracture. It's not. No, it's not. Thing. But <coughs> cool. Terry Kirby. And you get to all your sage hit. You might as well just flip right. all. I would not. Do oh yeah, that. these that are all. Oh yeah, yeah, that. these are all. So we'll just go through these, and even if they're big names, they're Doesn't sage matter. hit. Sage hit. All right, let's open up this pack oh, here. Still no hit. So, yeah, but I got this card. This makes it worth it all right there. That card Correct. is incredible. Look at his pants. Those are fire. <laughs> the Chargers colors. Oh, that is pretty fire, as Luke says. All right. Heat. Art Monk. Um, here is a Charger. Bird. Bird, I think, was a safety. Cedric Jones. Steve Walsh. Sam Mills was awesome. Ed Reynolds. The yeah, Patriots were he so was good fun. in 1990. And Mark Clayton. So they did actually go to that one Super Bowl. And what year was that? Yeah, they did. Like, <clears throat> just play the Giants, right? Yeah. And they just got dismantled. I think they did. I think it was LT, wasn't it? Or am I thinking of the? Or was that the Bills uh, and the Giants? Maybe that was Bills Bears. and I'm Giants. Sure they played the Bears. Oh, they may have played the Bears. <clears throat> they did get smoked, but yeah, they got smoked. Um, I want to say it was like in the late 80s, but I don't know. All right, so let us know in the comments below what you think of these. Um, Definitely interesting. Another football news, the new Brady documentary came out, the first episode. I haven't watched it yet. I'll watch it tonight. What channel is that on? It's on ESPN+. ESPN+, Plus. okay. Yeah, I don't know. There he is. Tom's brother, Kyle. I'm not expecting it to be super good because I heard someone say this and it makes a lot of sense. Like the Jordan documentary obviously aired live during COVID, obviously. Right. But the ESPN picked it up because they obviously it was very well done. Uh, this documentary, no one picked up the rights to. Like nobody bought it oh, out. And they're basically yeah. saying if this was really, really good, like Netflix or somebody would have right, bought it. Right. Well, and, and you know, and if he ESPN still has the rights to it, they would have just showed it on their regular. Thing. Right, but Probably. he's still playing, and I, there's something about when somebody hasn't, you know, when their career's been over, and you, you know, there's that nostalgia, and then you kind of wonder what they're up to, and then they can kind of reflect back. So I don't know. He's also like not the most. I mean, Jordan, I guess, wasn't really like the most uh, super <clears throat> crazy, interesting, wild person ever. But the other, like Dennis Rod, I mean, all of them, that all those stories right. are super interesting. Yeah. Brady is definitely, he is a very smart person when it comes to the media. Doesn't say anything super outlandish or wild. Um, and is pretty, there we go. Pretty flat, I guess, kind of boring. Oh, Rodney Pete, former USC quarterback, Detroit Lions first round draft pick, who didn't really ever do much, like almost all of them. Hey, Jared Goff, 
Could win the MVP this year. Don't count him out. Right. He may be benched. Um, he should be. The worst trade in NFL history. Yeah, it was a total salary cap dump for the Lions. Well, I think it was more Matthew Stafford one of state anyway. So well, it's right. like, let's try to get something right. for him. Right, try to get something, yeah. I feel like they could have gotten a little bit more, but I don't know. My favorite card of all time right here. That's pretty sweet. I like yeah, that. Look at his armbands, too, his wristbands. Those are pretty sweet. All right, there you have it. No hit there, but let us know what you think. Four ninety nine. Um, <laughs> hopefully you guys are doing well. Have a great weekend uh, and if you don't watch any of our videos before Thanksgiving, have a great Thanksgiving. And a lot of people start to travel even this coming weekend and beginning of next week. So busy time of year. Hopefully everybody's doing well. Um, please hit that like button, uh, comment below, and also subscribe to the channel. Love to add you as a subscriber. We'll be doing more football breaks. So we can get our hands on some uh, wax. Do you have any idea what, what the latest, newest product com is coming out retail-wise? Retail wise, um, Stadium Club Chrome Baseball could potentially be out, but that really hasn't. I doubt that'll be on the shelves this weekend. How about for football? Update should be coming out. Football wise, you have Absolute, uh, which will continue to be out. It's been oh, yeah. out. Um, Dunner's Holiday. Have you seen it on the shelves? Absolute. Yes. Yeah. It came oh out yeah, I, I saw it. Yeah. Um, and then Mosaic Football would be like the next big retail release right, that comes out. That'll be good. Um, and that I think is supposed to come out like the second week in December, if I remember correctly. So fairly okay. soon. Um, and then Mosaic, in terms of basketball, Mosaic, yeah, Mosaic basketball, basketball comes, out comes out fairly soon yeah. as well. So those will be the two big ones. But All right. Well, stay tuned for those. And uh, if we can get our hands on some, we'll be showing you those on the channel. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Have fun collecting. We'll see you soon.